All right, today we're going to show you how to mount the original roof rack from Tesla on the Model 3. And in the next video, we're also going to show you how to mount the um, roof box that you can put on here to get some more storage when you're on a trip. Okay, so the first thing uh, you need to do is to um, mount these protectors and as you can see here uh, you have an indicator saying that here is the uh, mounting point for the front uh, rack and here is the one for the back one and then you have to put uh, push this uh, ceiling aside so you just take this tool that's included and you uh, open it up and then you push um, the mounting uh, that is uh, included in the roof rack in here. Okay, so we're going to do that. Okay, so you get four of these that's going to each of the mount points and as you can see here, it's clearly indicated uh, here which one uh, this is. So you can see this is the front left one. Uh, this the arrow indicating it's the front and you can also see that uh, it's like a dart missing here. So this is the one. It's very intuitive and you just take this bracket there's four of those they are all the same and you put it in there yep and then you put this one on top and you pull the tool out uh, that um, you use to push the rubber ceiling to the side yeah, and then you do this on all the four corners. So we go to the next one. And you can see here, it's this one. Yeah. And the first time you do this, it can be a bit tricky. And also if you have um, the rubber band in here that I showed in uh, the last video or another video, uh, it, it, you, you will need to remove it or it, at least it will be more tricky. Well, let's find out. This is my car and uh, this is the rubber band. So let's try to get this tool in here. I push it to the side. No, so it's, it seems like it's, it's not possible. But if we just move this up just for a while, let's see if it's possible to do it this way. Okay, so that's down. And then we move, we move it back. Yeah, so that seems to be the trick. You have to uh, remove remove the rubber band just for a while and then you can put the other things on. And then you put the rubber band back before you uh, put the rubber ceiling on. Yeah, so that seems to work nicely okay so there you go it's possible with the rubber band uh, on the other hand uh, it will be a bit more noisy uh, with the roof rack on anyway so but it's uh, good to not have to mount it and unmount it every time you want to use the roof rack okay so let's mount the roof rack itself all four of these are now mounted So you, these tools are also included and um, you have a key so you can lock it so no one can steal it and uh, this screw should be tightened with five to six newton meters so you don't break anything 
and if you use this smaller part uh, it's uh, about the, the right amount of force that you need and you will not overdo it okay and you also align this dot yeah with that dot and then you can lock and it's secured and the final thing then is to just put the cover on we will do that later on okay so then the other side same thing here right and then the front one And then we have these covers that you put on afterwards and um, yeah there's no indicators or anything but it's kind of obvious how to uh, fit them because here you see it doesn't fit yeah here it does so just push it in and push it down and it snaps in and the same here Perfect. All right, so that's how you mount the roof rack. That's uh, the original roof rack from Tesla. And um, in the next video, I will show you how to mount the roof box on top of this. Thanks for watching. Drive safely and see you in the next one.